Integrated vegetation management is incorporating all the tools in the toolbox. So you have choices you can make. You can, you can hand cut, you can mow it, you could broadcast treat, um, you can selectively treat. What IVM ends up being is that you take those best practices, incorporate them at the right time, so that it then takes it to the next stage where you take advantage of biological control. The mission of IVM Partners is to teach the utilities, primarily starting with the electric utilities, how to manage vegetation, not just maintain it. So the utilities end up saving money and you improve habitat for pollinators, birds, and other wildlife. We started a project with Bear supporting us. Uh, it started back in, in 2015. And what we were looking at is that we share some of the same goals in that you know, Bear produces products that are the herbicides that allow us to do our management. They're also very interested in pollinator habitat, primarily bees and, and, um, and butterflies, and they have a bee center in uh, Durham. Uh, so it was, it was a good fit for them to support our educational efforts. Every day is different. The, the customers that we work with are, they have so many different unique uh, issues and, and problems that we're trying to solve. We're developing this, this partnership between um, IBM Partners as well as, as our customers trying to, trying to document uh, the benefits of using IVM on, on their properties and, and showing them that using IVM can help them promote pollinator habitats, uh, which in turn really, I think, is a, is a good sustainability message to their customers. What we, we need to do, as many people say, manage uh, vegetation, and that's exactly what we endeavor to do. And we go out and we determine what is, uh, what is the target plants and what are the non-target plants. And the non-target plants are generally those that are ones that are not going to interfere with the infrastructure that we're working on, for, whether it be electrical utility or a gas pipeline, and that they, it makes no difference whether we do anything or not. So we'd rather leave it um, for erosion control reasons, for wildlife benefit reasons, and so forth. Um, but in addition to that, there are many species that uh, uh, certain animals uh, depend on for a food source, particularly on right-of-ways, because if you think about a right-of-way, most people that know anything about biology knows that the edge effect is, is uh, the concentration point for most wildlife. It, it's a nexus between uh, an open area and uh, uh, deep forest. And right now in the United States, 63 million acres are in right-of-ways, whether it be highway right-of-ways, railroad right-of-ways, uh, electrical right-of-ways, or gas pipeline right-of-ways. You start thinking, you know, more people need to see this. We need to get the message out. Um, and I think it's just a matter of time until people really understand what this is all about and the benefits. It, it's quite, quite, um, amazing to stand there at the end of the right-of-way and look out and see all the butterflies and the, and the plants and the forbs and say, you know, this is what we, what we set out to do. This is what they set out to do a number of years ago, and, and here it is. This is the finished result. We also have the people that Bayer brings to the market, which are knowledgeable and, um, and very good at, at uh, educating uh, the applicators on how to use the product properly and where to use the products. What Bayer has done is uh, allowed us through uh, use of their um, representatives to have workshops, field days, and things of that sort where we can actually demonstrate the, the products, and the proper use of those products in the field, and um, also educate the employees to the point where they can, are ready to, to be tested uh, for certification for certain states. I, I like this partnership because we, we can't do it alone. Bear cannot do it alone. We can't do it out without our customers without our partners, and we partner with many different organizations, IVM partners, as well as a number of DOTs, again, to try to spread this message, spread the good word. And it's very rewarding to see this act in action and um, is, is, a, is a good part of my job.